My name is Jessica Learman Creaky. I'm a resident of Hampstead. These shops, there are four shops that have been affected. Um, there is Polly's Cafe, which we're sitting in at the moment, which has been here for 18 years. There is a small florist. There is a charity shop next door to that. There is a well loved stationers, which is on the other side of us. Uh, independent shops are recognised as the heart of the community because people leave their houses, they go to the shop, which is round the corner, they bump into their friends. For the elderly, it is a lifeline. Uh, Sainsbury started leafleting the residents to let them know that they were coming in. So everyone was taken quite by surprise because they had no advance warning that this was going to happen. On this particular campaign, um, there were eight local groups who were involved. And so I set up the structure or the bridge, if you like, over troubled water um, and set up the petition. I wanted to bring it to a, the, the, the attention of the senior team, which I was able to do by attending the AGM. Um, and I then asked the chair if he would allow me to hand him personally the petition, which I had taken with me, which was signed by over 2,000 people at that stage, it was announced that Sainsbury's were pulling out of this particular project. Online campaigning is invaluable because it helps to spread the word very quickly. Uh, it helps people to feel part of their campaign immediately. It's very easy to set up a petition. What have members of the community been saying to you since Sainsbury's oh, decided to pull out? Every day we're getting people in actually saying congratulations, we're pleased. So, I mean, I've had some support for me. Yeah, so it's been nice. Oh, wow. And That's it's really kept good. the community together, I think, more, isn't it? Yeah, everyone's come together. Yeah. Which, and then we're more unified than we've ever been. So I, I challenge anyone else to come and try and ruin the parade. Exactly. <laughs>